I think that is all. I'm just going to enjoy this race because this is uh, my favorite track, one of my favorite track of the circuit. So I will try to do a clean run. I will try to push myself as hard as I can, but you know, in control. So training went well today. On this kind of track, I think it's good to go step by step and the track changed a lot. So this morning I took it a bit easy and uh, yeah, did a, a run after the guy practiced. The track was so destroyed, that was crazy. is just to finish the qualify and final in the top three then I can keep the jersey so for sure I would give my best but maybe maybe I won't go like crazy or do something unreal I just ride like I ride normally and I'm sure that will work Quali didn't go as planned, I had a crash, didn't see that coming, it broke with my pedal and went over the bar. I was bummed with this, really disappointed, but ended up full so it's not too bad and uh, yeah, pretty confident for tomorrow. So still coming up. She's over three seconds up now then. Is Pom Pom riding towards her first ever World Cup victory? This is looking good. She knows she doesn't have to win this race to take the overall. So it's quite smart from her staying in control. If it's green, it's gonna be, then she's gonna be your 2017 UCI Daniel World Cup overall. It's Pom Pom who does it. Well, there she goes. She takes the title for the first time in her career. She is the World Cup champion.
I won the overall last weekend in Val di Sol and that was my main goal for me. So now here's just bonuses. I'm having fun on a track. I'll give my best and I'll see what happens. You may be high You may be low For me that was almost a perfect season but not perfect yet and just want to thank all my team, Commentar, Varner team, they have been amazing, we did such a good work, all my sponsors, the bike is perfect so thank you guys. You